How to solve integral of square root 2 a x minus x square dx? So it is an interesting math. First of all, I can say integral of square root 2 a x minus x square and minus a square plus a square dx. Look, I just add a square and again I subtract a square so there is no change then I can say integral of square root look here is minus is common so here is minus and this is minus so it will be plus x square this is plus this is minus so it will be minus 2 a x and this is minus this is minus it will be plus a square bracket this a square dx then i can say here is integral of square root look this is a square so this a square and this minus and we know that a square minus 2 a b plus b square it will be a minus b whole square so here is a is x and b is a bracket power is 2 dx then integral of let x minus a is equal to a sine theta then i can say derivative of x it will be dx by d theta and it is a constant so it is zero is equal to a cos theta then then i can say it will be dx is equal to a cos theta this d theta then i can say integral of square root here is a square minus you know that x minus a it will be a sine theta and here is a square so it will be a square sine square theta and dx it will be a cos theta d theta so i can say a cos theta d theta then this equation becomes integral of square root look here is a square is common so a square this divide this it will be 1 and this divide this it will be sin square theta bracket here is a cos theta d theta then I can say integral of look square root is cancelled so it will be a and a times a it will be a square and here is square root 1 minus sine square theta so we know that square root 1 minus sine square theta it will be cos square theta and here is cos theta d theta then I can say it will be a square look square root cancel so it will be cos theta cos theta times cos theta it will be cos square theta d theta then i can say here is a square cos square theta d theta because of that a square is constant then i can say it will be a square over 2 2 cos square theta d theta I divide by 2 but again I multiply by 2 so 2 to cancel again we are find out previous line then I can say it will be a square over 2 integral of the trigonometric rules 2 cos square theta it will be 1 plus cos 2 theta bracket d theta then I can say this equation becomes a square over 2 integral of 1 d theta it will be theta plus integral of cos 2 theta it will be sine 2 theta and 2 theta it will be 2 bracket plus c but remember that theta is x minus a a sine theta so i can say a x minus a a sine theta and it will be sine theta is equal to x minus a over a then i can say here is theta is sine inverse 
x minus a over a then i can say here is a square over 2 theta plus 2 sin 2 theta over 2 plus c now i put on the value of theta in this case so i can say here is a square over 2 remember that theta is sin inverse x minus a over a so i can say in this case sin inverse x minus a over a plus sin 2 theta the trigonometric the trigonometric rules 2 sin theta cos a theta over 2 plus c then i can say here is 2 to cancel so again i can say e square over 2 sin in bars x minus a over a and here is a sin theta it will be x minus a over a remember that sin a theta it will be x minus a over a so i can see easily here is sin theta is equal to x minus a over a and cos theta it will be square root 1 minus sin square theta because of that we know that uh, what is the value of cos theta but we know that the value of sin theta then here is plus c then it will be a square over 2 bracket sin inverse x minus a over 2 plus x minus a over a here is a this is a and square root 1 minus sin square theta we know the sin theta is equal to x minus a over a bracket power is 2 plus c then i can say this equation becomes a square over a times sin inverse x minus a over a plus x minus a over a square root uh, here is least common value is a square so a square times 1 it will be a square minus a square divide a square it will be 1 this is a minus b whole square so it will be a square minus 2 a x plus a square bracket plus c then I can say a square over 2 and it will be sin in bars x minus a over a plus x minus a over look this a and this a it will be a square because of that square root and this square is cancelled where find out here is a a times a it will be a square and here is square root a square plus minus it will be minus x square and minus minus it will be plus 2x and minus plus it will be minus a square bracket plus c then i can say here is a square a square cancel so we'll find out the value of this integral is this a time this it will be a square over 2 sine inverse x minus a over a plus this time this it will be a square square cancel so x minus a over this 2 and it will be square root look 2 a x minus x square and this plus c this is our final answer thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel goodbye